Hi, I am Moshumi Majumdar from Department of Anatomy and Cell Biology and I work with Dr. Piyush Lala. Today I am going to tell you how to erase breast cancer in a very simplified way. Just imagine a beautiful garden, but you need to clean weeds from the roots. They come back again if you do not eliminate the roots. For cancer, that root is stem-like cells or SLCs. Even after getting all kinds of therapy, radiation, patient come back with tumor in other part of the organ once these SLCs are escaped from the therapy. They are so smart in masking them from all kinds of therapy and radiation. Currently, there are 5,600 publications right now trying to identify how they, you can define them or how to eradicate them. As a TBCRU and CART fellow, I ask a different question. Who is helping them? How these guys are so smart in masking themselves from all kinds of strong therapy we have? When I joined Dr. Lala, he already established that COX-2 is very important for breast cancer, aggression, and metastasis. I ask whether COX-2 can also stimulate these SLCs? Answer is yes. Who is helping them? Just imagine each cell like a factory, making 1,000 copies of DNA, RNA. These are all messenger releasing them in the blood, carrying all the message. Whenever required, tumor is on. We identified COX-2 actually inducing two such small molecule or messenger molecule called microRNA. They are free floating in the blood. They are actually helping this SLC to switch on whenever required. How to identify them? We just need two ml of blood. It's just how you poke your finger just to test blood sugar. And from detection to identification, how many copy of those you have, takes five hours. Importantly, these two microRNA, we observe that very high in tumor compared to the control, like non-disease tissue. As the disease progress, their num number is getting higher and higher. And if patient have more than 80% of these microRNA, they are going to die in next five years. And we are testing drugs which can efficiently reduce these SLCs and microRNA. Traditional biopsy needs at least five days to confirm whether you have the disease or not. But this technique needs just five hours. As you can see, this study is definitely time saver, money saver, and definitely life saver.